am by myself today. Day one, Douglas Lake, the Southern Open. The only one I'm fishing in the Southern. I Flight number three, fishing. take attack, 305s, 23, Preston Julian. And uh, I've Cliff Pace, the 24. Today. Got to Cliff, follow that one in front of you. 335 check in. We'll see what happens. Um, kind of have the water to myself, which is kind of a good thing, I guess you could say. I have, I can fish any way I want. Clean. I don't have to. Adam Rasmussen. I don't have to worry about That's anybody casting ahead. over me or behind Eddie me. Ball, 26. <laughs> so straight ahead. We'll uh, turn it on when I go through uh, check out. Go through the line here, and then we'll take it there. You got it, Trevor. You got two more to come by. You're behind the Ranger. Mike Kiso Jr. behind this Phoenix right here. There you go. Jump in there, Trevor. What's your number? 58. I'm right behind you. Johnny Biggers, both 60, straight ahead. Brent Shores, 61. Follow the uh, 44 tackle wrap. 62, Danny McClone. Follow the aqua call wrap. Dice K and Coley. <laughs> Behind the Blue Phoenix. There you go, Dice K. Come on around that Phoenix. <sighs> Billy Master Jr. at 64. Where's Billy? You're behind Dice K. Come on up. Split the uprights there, Billy. Split the uprights. Yep. Can you see him? There you go. Perfect. Right behind the one right in front of you. Tight code. Yep. Follow the one. 335, right. 61. Pull out of the way. Pull it kiss with You got buddy. Senior at 166. Got one more coming down your left side. Don't be behind it. Here I go. Here we go. Big. Followed it. I guess I probably should get my scales out and everything else and start getting things going here. One forty nine. Be another one up there. Let's see. I practice. I caught two or three off of this, and I left. They seem to be schooled up on out in the space here, and I went all the way in, and nothing wants to work today. Nothing. Went all the way in and had some bites down this bank and I quit. I'm going to go inside the cove though and try it with some spinner baits here in a second. But thought I'd hit the point first before I went in and caught that pound and a half or that's one. I just need four more now for a limit. That's the first one in the morning. I just got bit.
I just got hit right there. He didn't take it. Crazy. Brush or something down there. There he is. Oh, little guy. That's probably 12 inches. We might as well put him in the boat and get it over with. He's 13. inches so we can't get another Turn it off, save some battery, and then see what happens. This is better fish here. Come here, baby. Come here. Yes. So two and a half, maybe. Two and a, over two, maybe. Maybe. Let's find out. There's three. He's two pounds. That's what he is. Two pounder. 
Get right up there. Dang geese, get out of here. I got geese up there now wanting to swim where I'm fishing. There's three right here. I need a new lizard on there. I got a nice little tree to flip in there. We'll see what happens. I'll probably Turn the camera on on that one for sure and see if I can't flip around and get one out of it. We'll see. cold this morning 50 degrees As you can see there's clouds it's supposed to be 40 but a little warmer than expected Again, can't catch him with it on. Number four. Number four. Probably watched me caught it. Alright, this is another two pounder, I think. Yes, sir. Wow. Aggressive fish got my glasses wet, too. 207. Let's get another one. One more makes the limit, Ming. Yeah, Ming. That's a nice fish. Another two pounder. There's a lot of fish on my screen right here. A lot of fish. I can't seem to get them on reaction baits. I've been throwing rattle traps and spinner baits and do some top water. Nothing. Something wants to be deeper again. And it could be because of the water dropping, but and then the shad seems to be out deep too. So that I think that drives them out just as deep. So we'll see. I may have to put a new lizard on, I don't know. But uh Work this point. Yeah, this lizard's gonna, this lizard's gonna suck. It's already feeling like crap already. So yeah, I think it already doesn't, you know, it doesn't have any glide down there. Come on, bigger ones, where you at? There's <laughs> uh, five. And red is on. 
get a weight. Let's see if I can't call a couple fish right here. He's a 183. I got into a school of fish here. See how long I can take advantage of that. Might as well beat it up. If I come out here with 10 pounds, I'd probably be a happy camper and really go hunt for some bigger ones. That's what I'm hoping for. Let's see what we get on this guy. Must be a pile of pile of them down there. All, all males though. Man, they are just everything's swimming down there on my on my, on my Garmin here. Just everything is just going crazy down there. I mean, I see fish everywhere, just going everywhere. I'm catching these fish a little deeper than normal today. I don't know if the storm last night, all day yesterday, had an effect on them this morning. Pulled all the fish out shallow. Found them out here in a little deeper water where they were grouped up. I don't know. I can't get any reaction bites. Come on, give me a chunk. Where is that chunk? Chunk fish. Need that chunk. Love to put a five pounder on film, man. That would just make my day. I mean, caught one over three. I've only caught a couple of three pounders. That's it. On practice, I haven't caught one over three yet. Be nice. Would be nice. Man, there is schools of fish in there. Casting ones. I think I cast it too deep. It seemed like there's a perfect little edge. That's almost my limit. That's my limit right there. Found this on practice when I first day I came in here. I had a guy cut me off in there. I stayed out here and I caught three in a row and I was like, hmm, well, we're going to leave this for the tournament. And I never came back and I caught five. Gosh, there's a lot of fish in there. Swimming around. Just brought one of them donkeys into biting them. This could be a jerkbait spot, maybe. I pulled it out, thinking I can get it down there. Maybe I can get one to hit it, other than a white bass. Man, come on! I know there's another one. Come on! having to finesse the fish didn't expect that on this event so far I'm struggling with the spinner bait chatter bait those kind of bites rattle trap bites crankbait bites I'm struggling with it I hear people catching fish on it but I'm struggling but with the water dropping I mean I might maybe I need to go deeper deeper I don't know I mean I could put one on at any given minute Thought I'd try top water because they were busting all around me, but I couldn't get anything to. I think it was white bass pushing them up.
boat that came in was just cranking. I don't know if he has any or not, but he didn't stick around on that corner long. And, and on that corner that I, I'll go hit it again on the way out, but I got to go in there and try spinner baiting and trapping again and see what happens. So I got to turn the camera off just to catch one. And it's a real subtle bite. If you don't recognize it, you're gonna miss fish. I haven't had a, a thump yet this morning. It's just been there. A lot of boats out here fishing. The last five days. Gotta affect some of these some of these fish. Let's call a fish. You know it's here. Wow, there's so many fish down there. getting low. Ah, dang it. Look what I just did. I just called a fish. For sure. As you can tell. I got a pound three quarter here. Come on, kickers, where you at? Yep, pound seven eight. Again, probably almost a pound. So I basically have two, four, six, seven, eight, and nine nine pounds for five fish at the moment so I'll update my bass tracker and move on five fish I'd say nine dash oh three we'll call it that <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. We'll try it again. I was getting my pants off and he bit. It's getting warm. If I can get one more coal, that'd be great. Get rid of a pound and a half where I got in there for another quarter. It'd be great. Seems like there's a bunch of close to two pounders in here. But you know how it is. Can't catch fish with the camera on. <laughs> Good. Look at those spots. Black dot. It calls. All I got to say.
218. Sweet. Oh, I got a big one. Come here, sweetie. Bleeding, but get it injuries. It's gonna replace the green. Green. over three keep it on here so I know I got five in the bucket I'm not gonna tag it until it calms down and gets uh we'll give it some fresh water and continue to do that until it calms down and we'll put a little bit of a uh, stuff in there don't want any sick fish on me Fish. Looks like he's doing fine. I'll tag him in a minute. Good fish. I don't want to stress him out right now. <laughs> we are calling boys calling 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 my next smallest is a 183 which is red i saw it until you did that stop it Buried it up. I saw it. There's the dog. It's always the one you want, right? Uh, come here. I got him swimming in all directions in here. There it is. Nice call, huh? Fish is going away. Two thirteen. Got a half pound call right there. So I have two, four, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven and a half pounds. Point's got a bunch of fish down there. I saw them on the ground, swimming around. They're out underneath this big old bait ball that I just cast it into. In about 12 foot of water. Maybe a little deeper, but we'll see if I can't get another one. There's just a pile of fish. I can see it. There's a dark spot up there, and that's the bait ball. I'm gonna shout about that big.
Yeah, about 15, 16 foot deep in there. I'm in 15, 16 right now. Both of those fish came in between uh, 10, 11 to 14. So, yeah. I should hit my spot lock and see if I can. Yeah. <laughs> Got a nice breeze coming off this point. I think they're stacked up here because the fish are blowing out. We've got the comrades over there. Let's see what happens here. Get a little adjustment. Boy, it's a light bite, man. All of a sudden it's there. in here and practice the other day and I caught three in there and they were better fish than what I was normally catching so then I catch one almost about three pounds right there and a two and a quart so I called two right here but I'll probably have to turn the camera off again <laughs> It's been good. I can't seem to get that reaction bite to go go. I don't know. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Maybe I got the wrong bait. I don't know. I can't seem to get it to really, really go. I can get a fish for two, but I can't get multiples like I can on this one. Right now. As you can see, I haven't taken my coat off and it's cold. The wind's blowing. Not bad, but it's cold. I bet it's 55 degrees out. That cloud, that sun gets behind that cloud. Woo! Chilly. I've been catching small fish. I haven't caught anything that would do anything. I haven't filmed any because I've been focusing too hard on trying to get a call here and it's just been it's like the light shut off all I'm catching is 12 and 13 14 smaller fish when I got in the bucket I thought I'd run it for a minute or two and see if I can't get a fish on film here I've been catching them right here same thing. He didn't catch anything. My lips are chapped. I'm trying to work with the gut of this cut right here. Maybe there's something in the middle. But... I see fish swimming around. Big bait balls of shad. White bass with them. Possibly crappie. If there's any see anything big swimming in them but it's like that <clears throat> I 
put on my other coat. But it just gets heavy. Gotta be a fish right there. Catching them. I had a couple ripped the tail off of my lizard. I haven't tagged that big one in there. Let's see what he weighs compared to gosh dang it, stop it. It's just pounds. Smallest fish I got is orange and he's two pounds. I can check him one more time. Plus. All right, let me get to this. We'll take it in there. I don't want to have fish getting everywhere. All right, I cleaned everything up a little bit, and uh, it was it didn't call. It was, it was, the other one was 202, and that one was two pounds even. So I got to go with the 202. Good feeling though. It's a 220. I have a 335 weigh in. Technically, I have one hour left. I mean, I see some fish swimming around. I don't know. Nobody's fishing. I, I practiced. There were some people all over this stuff. I was catching fish behind them. They must not have been catching them in front of me. I don't know. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. I can't figure it out to find bigger, bigger, bigger bites. I should be. I mean, I had a. We had. A, you can see on our practice, we had some good days and some bad days. But this lake's been dropping, and in, in, in the chart says it was. It stopped, and I swear it dropped another eight inches. I saw stuff out of the water that wasn't out of the water on uh, Tuesday. So, I think this lake's dropping. We're on the first day of practice. I can't buy a fish, and we caught do a dozen in there. And that was a week ago. And now, nope. <laughs> That's going to. Well, here we go. I'm going to get the weigh in right here. See what I did. Fish out of the bucket. These are my weigh in bags, by the way.
Alright, let's head up to weigh in. Oh. Help me there. See? You don't. Do you need I to? Dump it. You take oh. the dish. Thank, thank you, ma'am. Uh -huh, thank you. Ranger Cash Awards. Our top prize for our top citizen total over $51,000. Too bad. Thank you, Ranger. Since I'm going down this road, I'm going to give a huge shout out to our friends at Mercury because I. Sponsor our top pass award on the co side. It's going to be just about, just a little over actually, $18,500. So appreciate uh, both folks helping us out big, big time this week. Of course, all of our other sponsors can't do it without Bass Pro. They are our pro instrument, instrumental, basspro.com. Of course, our title sponsor. Got to give a big shout out. To our good friends at Toyota, and remind you this is a Toyota bonus bucks eligible event, contingency award, contingency award for uh, anglers that are registered to the bonus bucks program. 61, Peter Boats, Yamaha Outboards, Cumberbird Electronics, Mid Dakota, Toyota Motor, Chad World. Powerful, can't make you famous. Yeah, make famous huh? Look at that. Oh, I mean. yeah, you need to be famous, sir. <laughs> <Once again, visit laughs> I'm a Jefferson County. I'm a Jefferson County. Thank you. Over the last 10 years, uh, they rolled that carpet out. They do everything to take care of us, including the like, great, great folks at the Volunteer Fire Department. Mike Dalton's got himself three fish, co anchor side. Five pounds, 12 ounces, 512, thank you. Brent Shores, Mosey, Idaho. What's up? I'm doing well, how you doing Brent? Okay. Good, good, good you bet. Five fish limit player. Good start, 11 pounds, 13 ounces, gonna have you inside, right at 20. Top, top 20 right now for you Brent, yeah, give him a round of applause. Good job. Grab him, Thanks, give him a drunk, take him to the boat. Thank you. Thank you. There we got Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome, honey. Woo! Oh, hey, from Shepherdsville, <laughs> Kentucky. <laughs> he won in 2020 on the BassPro.com Bassmaster Central Open Series, Lake Louisville. Come on up, hey, bud. Going to the Bassmaster Classic. I thought I'd it's share the whole <laughs> experience. <laughs> all right. Look at all the work they do to keep these things alive. Aren't those awesome weighing bags? Oh, yeah. Those are my weighing bags. But thanks, buddy. You're welcome. See how simple this is? Everything. Woo. Well, 11.13. Not bad. Better than, I mean, 15 pounds leading it, so it tells you a lot of small weights coming in. So, um, I'm gonna go get my truck. I'm all by myself. I can go beach it. Get myself out of the water and head back, do some retying, and we're set. Stay tuned. We're gonna. I draw a, a person tomorrow, so we're fishing tomorrow. We'll uh, figure it out. Remember to have your navigationals in on. I got a bar today. All that good stuff. Russell Hall. Russell Hall. Russell Hall. We're excited to From up point 14 South Carolina, check time of Newton, 4 North Carolina. Newton, North Carolina. I got a Newton, North, North Carolina with me. That's pure East Coast. I'm pure West Coast. Oh, We're going to go out Eagle. and bang it today. We got a 505 way in. And um, we'll see we what we can do. The, oh, keep the flag um, up. We're going to get close. Hopefully, we we'll get a good limit each. Set up a week. Gotcha, Bill. I'm sitting in 62nd. Black Bird Halter, 146. Yeah. He within, has, within, he's sitting within and I have no idea. <laughs> 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 yeah. We are. And uh, I hope uh, we both can do it today. Daniel Royce, 148. And, uh, we'll see what happens. 
We'll uh, go through the line here in a minute. We're about 160 out. Oh, sorry. Day two. Thank you. Douglas Lake. If I get more like that, check this out. I didn't get this one on film, but. But I got one, a grown one. Look what I can do. Oh, that's a three plus, isn't it? It's gotta be. Quick wait. 306. Five of those would be would be uh sweet. <laughs> Ronin. Next. Maybe. Yeah? yeah. There we go. Solid one, eh? Yeah, not bad. That's what I was catching here yesterday. A lot of these. I had nine pounds when I left. Look at me. I feel like I know what I'm doing a little bit maybe today. Tags before? Gosh, first time I ever seen those. See this? They don't pinch. See how they don't touch the jaw? Yeah. The fish is relaxed in the live well, right? And uh, so the tags, you weigh the fish. That's a 187. And then you dial in the weight. And you're back to fishing. Gosh. First time I ever seen those. Yeah. Now I'm going to do a text track so my son, that's you Andrew, can see how I did. Now I've got two fish, so I can go two, space, I'd say five, uh, three, four, four, eight, four, nine, let's see, four, dash, oh, nine. <laughs> let's catch another. Boy, he was hard pressed. That's a two and a half, I think, isn't it? That's a good one. Yeah! And yeah, we picked up some accounts we've never had before because of. Hang on one sec. Woo! He had a little bit of strength to his body. Three, two, two, zero. <laughs> Doing a quart. Sweet. I got bigger fish today. <laughs> All right, we'll catch another. Look at this. Holy moly! Yeah. Woo! Oh my gosh, I feel like I do know what I'm doing. I did come to the right spot. <laughs> Holy moly. Oh, where's, where were these yesterday? <laughs> they were here, they just didn't show up yet. Almost two and a half. Oh. 
Sweet. Oh my gosh. Did I find them today or what? I did make the right call. I was worried that uh, that would be four for, I think I got nine pounds. Yeah. We'll do that. Nine dash O2. Sweet. Check my line because I had I had a fish on earlier that I set the hook on and my weight it broke off right at the weight and uh, so I must have went right over a rock and it felt solid so it could have been a two and a half or it could have been a four I don't know but I'm doing pretty good with this right now I'm very happy very very thankful thank you should you. be yeah yeah maybe we can get one on film this cast Probably. Now that I got the camera on, I won't, I won't catch one. <laughs> That's been my forte on this thing. Everybody goes, you need to leave the camera on. I'm going to put Carolina rig on. You going to sit here for a few minutes? We're going to go everywhere I go. We're going to play around. You're fine. Yeah. Go yeah. ahead. Go I got ahead. Time. No, okay. no, no. I'll go back and forth a couple times. Yeah. You're fine. You want to put one together, go ahead. I just didn't want to start it if you're getting ready to move or something. I'll wait till you get it going and then I'll move. <laughs> you're on a pretty good spot. I don't know if you're gonna move quick that quickly. Oh, you never know about me. I'm from Idaho. Yeah. <laughs> you got a pair of scissors I can use? Yes, sir. Now, what's in this box? You gotta close your eyes and look. No, look. <laughs> there you go. That'll work. I'll put them up. Right? That's a secret box. Yeah. <laughs> I won't. I won't. I won't tell anybody I've seen anything. Because <laughs> I it hold another dead body if I have to put another one in there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, you know I'm joking, right? I have to tell everybody I'm joking because everybody takes everybody so serious nowadays. Yeah. Sarcasm is just like a unheard of thing anymore. It's a lost art. Yeah. Come on, let's get, let's get a five on film. I'll do the orange justice for you if I get a five on film. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was awesome. That's two off of that hump and two over there. So one more fish makes a limit for me. I think I can get my limit today. You should be able to hit it pretty quickly. Yeah, it's only 820, so. You got the 505. So. Yeah. I really would like to have a 15 plus pound sack today. That would be really sweet and tasty. You'll get it. Dude, that would, that would be great. I'd like to have a 20 pound sack and be fishing tomorrow. How much you got? 12 pounds? 11, 11? I had almost, almost 12 pounds. 11, 13. That's just 3 ounces shy of 12. And at this point right now, I'm already ahead of the game where I was at yesterday. You know what I mean? Yeah, you... I think if you get 16 pounds a day, you'll be fishing tomorrow. You think 16 will get me in tomorrow? I'd get 28 pounds. Yeah, it would, wouldn't it? You may it not would. take that much. On, huh? It may not take that much. Depends well, on how. It is Douglas depends Lake. on how everybody adjusts today. Or how bad they beat up their their spot spots, you know. Yeah. Uh, my friend's fishing the the uh, Ray Scott Championship on Chickamauga. Yeah. That, that's what happened to him. He beat all of his stuff up the first day. Nothing the second day. Oh. That happened to him. So. Yeah, I think you get 16 pounds a day. You or 14 a day. You possibly fishing tomorrow. Yeah. 
Well, that's why they're two and three days. So I'm for a reason. Yeah. Come on. I want that one back. One night. I'd like to catch that fish and take my hook out of its mouth. <laughs> I figured for a post-spawn spot, you know, it, this was it right here and there, and uh, and they were there, and these are all post-spawn fish I'm catching, so I can't find any spawners because the lake has dropped so fast. Now some new ones could come up today, I bet. That's got potential because the lake has leveled out. It has stopped dropping, and yeah, they quit dropping it. I think. Yeah. But it dropped seven feet basically in six, seven days. So, I mean, I was, I was catching fish in a different spot. And just, I can't find these post spawners to hit anything aggressively. I bet there's some pre spawners that are being pretty aggressive, but I can't find them. And I know they're here. And I feel pretty good about things. I probably gotta turn the camera off. I gotta catch a fish. Come on! I got your live well going. Here's your biker head, we have to eat. But yeah, compliment them on how hard our friends are. How hot our friends are. Yeah, well. <laughs> Did you finally get it? <laughs> All right. I got a 13 incher. I got spoiled to all these better fish, so I'm just gonna drop him in the live well. Put the red tag on him. I, I won't weigh this one because I know I need to call it. So I'll just keep it at 13 inches and call it good. But I got a limit. There's five. Five for uh, basically, I think 11 pounds. I'm ahead of the game at this time yesterday. So. I think he's 12. Oh, yeah. Do you need my board? Oh, that's 12. If you need it. Check. Yeah. Yeah. Right on. That's two. Lights were really tough. I probably caught eight more without the camera being on, and only because the battery died. Couldn't show any calls. Caught a jerk bait fish, a couple crank bait fish while I was charging it. Ah, uh, frustrations in tournaments. Spawn fish don't do well sometimes when that stuff happens. That Warm up a little bit finally. Well, I caught one, we'll see what it weighs. Let's see what it weighs. 
place here. It's gonna call to 205. I got back the quarter pound I lost. All right, now I'm sitting at two, four, six, eight, ten. I'll be a flat 11, 11 and a quarter. Shoot. Oh well. Frustrating. Very frustrating. Oh, it's a white bass. Oh, wow, bass. oh shoot. I thought maybe you had a small, a largey. <laughs> the wave is holding on you. Oh well. Frustrating. <laughs> well, 40. I'm not sure what place exactly. When I weighed in, I was in 45th. They only paid to 40. I had 12 pounds at weigh in. And um, that was my weight today. Unfortunately, I just, oh well. But first time I've ever been here in um, April and the uh, learning curve was pretty good. Um, I got a pretty good grasp. I was able to catch fish behind people, quality. Found schools, found the things, but hooking a fish super deep like that just was not good. I would have probably had four more ounces of weigh-in, unfortunately, but I didn't. But uh, I appreciate you guys watching, and I hope you enjoyed this for today. And my son's calling me, and uh, please like, subscribe, it helps.